we're going to be doing these blogs for you, this this blog series for you, my crew and I, and we don't really know that much about microphones because when you do video, if you can hear what the person's saying, everybody thinks you're doing good. So we're going to try to get all these high-end audio recordings, but we don't know what we're doing with microphones. So I was hoping I could corner you as one of our first sessions and get you to tell me about microphones and when you use what and what the differences are. Sure. Well, you got me. You know, that's funny you mentioned it. Most people with uh, video companies, they'll produce excellent video, but the audio, as long as they can hear it, they go, well, that's fine. But then when you listen to it back, there's a real big difference between what's acceptable or you can hear it and really great audio. Oh, Beautiful. yeah, like a CD versus, and a voiceover versus what you record in the field is totally different. And it can always sound really nice, you know, but it depends on what, my, like you said, what microphones you use. I see you've got everything set up here for a little microphone demonstration. Um, I was hoping for one. Well, I'll tell you what. You want to go through some mics? Yeah. Okay, the first one is the Sennheiser. Which I've got hooked up for you already. Yeah, you got 416. How convenient. This is the shotgun microphone, and basically it's very directional microphone. I'm going to give you a little demo here. Say check or test. Oh, test. Okay, test, testing. test, testing, 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 testing. Okay, got quieter. Testing, 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 no. testing, 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 testing. Seems like it has a lot more presence when it comes close to me. It's testing, good, good testing. Level. Yeah, but you sound quite a bit different than I do. Well, that's because oh. I'm... <laughs> hey, I like that. <laughs> I turn it back around again. Now, here we go. All right. I like that. That's much better. Okay. I mean, I heard you before, and so I wouldn't get rid of anything, but it, I would definitely be able to hear you more if the mic was pointed at, at you or me. Hello. Hello. <laughs> okay. This is really good. I haven't heard microphones demonstrated this way before. This is the microphone of choice for most all videographers. Any news, anything. If you see a video camera, usually you'll see a, a Sennheiser 416 mounted on it just because it does so great in the rain, hot weather, humid, everything. This thing just, you know. Which is why you got that for me. That's it. This thing just sounds great. Okay, uh, let's move on to some other stuff. Yeah, we might as well go to the, the high end here. Ooh, your chefs. There's a funny story about these, a rat shoot one of them in a video a shoot rat. in Minnesota. <laughs> it was sitting by the rat's cage. <laughs> we came come back after using it and there's like pieces of it in the rat's cage. <laughs> well, put your headphones on. Okay. And listen to this. Talk. Testing, 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 testing. Testing, 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 testing. Just say slower, it goes testing. Testing, 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 testing. You see what kind of quality you have? This is a hypercardioid, and it's one of the microphones that. If you're not familiar with the ship's product, the hypercardioid is the capsule right here, a small capsule. And then the filter, which they believe in doing everything at the microphone, the filter, anything that's done, if this is a cut filter, you mentioned handling noise. I usually set that at number two. That gets rid of most handling noise. And then the power supply for the microphone is right here. So you have the power, the, the, the cut one filter, and then the actual capsule, and you buy each one of these separate. And if you want to change the, the polar pattern of the microphone, say to figure eight or a cardioid, you put on a different capsule. And the capsules all run a thousand and up. You know, you're, you're into the four thousand, three, four thousand dollar range very quickly with these microphones. So that's enough on this. We'll go to something else now. That was a condenser microphone. Condenser being has a, a, a a diaphragm in it, a charged diaphragm. This Are is these a, all condensers that we just looked all at? All condensers. Okay. Here's another condenser. This is an Audio Technica, and this is mo mostly not for video people. This is for the studio. Can you hear it here? Yeah, I mean, I heard that one when I heard you on that one a lot quicker than I heard you on this one because you weren't pointing these at yourself. Okay. Let me. 
Okay. Testing, 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 testing. You get the idea. Yeah. But this one, you can see the diaphragm. The diaphragm in there is about this big, and the shifts, it's about a little tiny. Those are smaller. So basically, this is built for the studio. You can't take this thing outside. You can't be rough with it. You know, you've got to be very careful with these studio microphones. But it's a big diaphragm, and you get a very a, a nice, warm, round sound like, hello. Usually for, for oh, vo nice. somebody would say, oh, that's a cheaper microphone. Nonsense. This is a great sounding microphone. You can use this microphone in any situation. It's going to give you a pro sound. All right, I want to hear some more. Okay, so there you go. Now, that's a mic that I use a lot. This is a dy this is a dynamic microphone. We're going to turn off the phantom power here. It's not needed. Check, 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 yeah, check, check, it. check. This is a pretty good one. This is an Electro Voice hammer. I mean, you can really pound nails with this. Yeah, I know. I like the idea of a hammer. You know, it's, <laughs> it, it, I mean, That's what I want from a microphone. <laughs> as you can see from what we're doing today, a different microphone for different things and different people. Testing, 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 testing. Wow, you have to get this really close to really hear it very well. Testing, 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 testing. Because out to here, I'm not hearing it nearly as well. Testing, testing. It's almost gone. Testing, testing. It's right here. So if I were interviewing somebody, I'd like want this right up in their face. That's the way. That's the, the, an interview microphone. Generally, is right an inch to two inches from the mic from the, the lips. You don't want, you can't. Because I've got a job on Monday and I'm going to really have to stick it in their you face. Right up on them. Yeah, okay. This, this is what. Testing, what, testing, what testing, this testing, whole testing, thing testing, shows testing, you testing, is testing, is testing, 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 testing. Yeah, I've never really heard, seen a microphone demonstrated like what this. This is really great. Is that each one of these microphones has really distinct characteristics and you, you know, you have to decide what you want out of the microphone and then choose appropriately. I mean, this, there's nothing wrong with this microphone, but if you want to pick up somebody at 400 feet, this is not the answer. But as an interview microphone, I don't, in a room, because of reflected sound, this is not the answer. You want this microphone. You know, this this one wins hands yeah, down. Yeah, because if somebody was out yelling over there, you wouldn't hear them as well. Or if somebody's flailing the around and they hit the microphone like that, you do that to this microphone, you could you could wind up with junk. This thing, you know, hit it. It's going to bounce back and sound great. It's a hammer. Okay, so the next microphone we're going to do, it's a pressure zone microphone. And it has a little preamplifier built right into it. Okay, now I turned it on. Okay, so you have to use the phantom power in here. It's great for uh, a tabletop, an office, where you have people sitting around a desk and you can't mic everybody, so you just take No, that really... For the meeting I did today, that worked really well because there was like people all around this conference table, and it was picking, doing a really good job just picking put them up. This thing just—it's really easy to operate. Just hook it up like this. You just put it right in the center of all the voices, basically approximate the center, and it turns the table into a large microphone. The sound that's that's bouncing into it bounces into this, picks everybody up, and everybody's happy, and it sounds great. So it's, you know, it's... Yeah, that's, that's really good for some of my work. You know, we really don't have to go back and forth with our voice like this, but uh, you can hear how this sounds. I mean, yeah. You're, you're, and this is a lavalier microphone, and this is what, this is what uh, you've got on right there. I'm just going to put the little foam thing so you can basically see how it works. And you just plug it in. Turn the phantom power on knob here and there it should go yep there's the there's I the hear it. I hear it. okay so testing 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 I know that's the only word I know if I have to just come up with a word testing testing this is a mic 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 yeah it's got quite a bit of proximity effect with that one get it kind of close to you mount it and you don't want to 
Russell, the, you want to get it set yeah, in a nice place. Some rustling and of here. course, a lot of situations, there are microphones that are really very, a country man makes a, one that's very small, very hideable. Okay? I'm hearing a lot of handling noise. If I, if I do this roll off, now, now do it. So, yeah, that makes a big difference. Okay, so um, here's the roll I've, off. I've had people when I've had them in interviews and stuff, and they'll like be fidgeting and rubbing things. And if you turn the bass roll up off, on then it, it helps it a with lot. and you notice too with most people you can't say uh, don't move that no. that doesn't work okay. okay so you've got a pretty good uh, you know a pretty good overview of all kinds of microphones this is not all there are you know there's there's oh I know there's a bunch you've got more. a lot better ones than I do but this is a, a good start. You know, no, this was you, really this helpful. Gets you, gets you I've going. never heard of microphones demonstrated like this before. I'm really happy. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>